very, very old one. Okay, I'll uh, pass it round to Ashel. I'll give one more call out, see if anybody else is joining us, and then I'll pass it round to Dav. Uh, anybody else want to join the Cray Valley um, uh, top band at G-Zero UK and listening? Mike Zero, Japan Charlie Fox.
station, I think, um, might have been Frank's WMR. I, I just caught a bit of his call sign, I think, early on, um, but he was right down in the noise. Um, so that, that's, that's impossible. Um, but, uh, yeah, thanks, Merry Christmas to all. I've only just got my uh, antenna back in the air. Up in the air. Um, the, uh, the wire fell down about a month or a month or six weeks or so before Christmas. Yeah, Mike Zero JCF. Sorry, I wasn't quite listening and uh, not too sure who I followed. But very good evening, gents, uh, everyone. Apart from um, BUO, good signal. Um, <clears throat> tonight I'm using uh, the Yesu Fox Tango 101 Zulu Delta Mark III. Now, the AM FM position, i got a feeling this one's got the... Um, <clears throat> has got the uh, FM board fitted, not the AM board, which is a bit of a shame. Um, running about, uh, pe peaking about 30 watts here on the lower side band, but the SWR is about 3 to 1, maybe a little bit higher. But uh, I'm not too fussed about that. Um, I'm not driving the radio hard or anything. Uh, thanks for the uh, wishes there, Guy. Yes, I did have the dreaded COVID-19, uh, along with my good lady wife, uh, uh, the girls have seemed to have avoided it. Both my older daughters, elder daughters, both my daughters are in their twenties, is what I meant to say. Um, they, they both uh, avoided it like the plague, or at least the the assumption is because um, they've had no positive tests and uh, they've had no symptoms. But who can tell? Um, for me, it was um, I've had worse common colds, so uh, that that's that, that's the story. This end as they using as. Z, uh, Z, uh, ZD uh, Mark III. Um, it's very, very nice radio. Very neat and tidy. Um, it came from a silent key sale. I think uh, most people know the story anyway. And uh, yeah, it just uh, came with a big pile of other gits. Uh, uh, git? <laughs> Start again. Another pile of bits. Um, uh, basically, uh, it was a silent key from five years ago. And this was the last of the uh, the kit that the uh, widow couldn't get rid of. Basically, no one wanted it. So I made a donation to her calls. And um, she was more than happy with my donation. And I was more than happy with my inverted commas purchases. As I say, this thing's still got the tag on the side. And uh, it's got all of the manuals, all of the paperwork. Um, uh, the, the original owner was uh, had both a G3 and a ZS uh, call sign and most of the kit that I got had um, ZS um, power plugs on it. Uh, likewise, um, uh, all of the paperwork is in RAND and stuff like that. But, you know, um, it does drift a little bit. It drifts about 100 hertz um, every 10 minutes or so. So, you know, I have to correct every now and again. So, uh, without further ado, I believe I'm, uh, I'm not too sure. I believe I'm last in line. So, what I'll do is I'll hand it round to... Um, guy uh g0 oh, i'll give you some um uh some uh quick um reports as well uh g0 ukn uh five and nine plus ten uh g4 buo right back of the box but i will listen out for him the next time round uh dav um uh, wdv five and nine plus twenty i believe it was out the corner of my eye um frank five and eight um always a bit low to me frank considering you're just up the hill from me bit of a weird one that um G A M N Y um never heard him. I thought that was um G A 
MNY was um, our man over in Croydon, um, John. Is it John in Croydon or have I got them mixed up with a, a different call sign sounding similar? And then whoever passed it to me, real apologies. I wasn't, as I say, I wasn't paying attention. Didn't quite catch the uh, call sign. If Guy, you can uh, just let me know for my logbook um, and um, I'll fill my logbook in. But you was a uh, 5 and 9 plus 15 and uh, a nice audio. And I am recording this for my YouTube channel so you can all see and sound uh see and hear what you sound like see i can't even speak tonight it's uh, it's mental uh back to you guy gkukn from m0 jcf on the cray valley uh, top band net Mark that uh, JMNY is John and he's over in uh, Croydon. I wonder if you're back with us, John. 
I think G3 uh, WMR was calling in there, Guy. Mike Zero, Juliet, Charlie Fox. Yeah, it was Golf 3, Whiskey Mike Radio. Um, he, I forget what aerial he said he was using. He was about a 5-5 five and five to me. A 5-5 five and five guy, back to you. Well, do you want to go ahead and have a couple of overs with him? Yeah, Golf 3, Whiskey Mike, Ra- Whiskey Mike Radio. This is Mike Zero, Juliet, Charlie Fox. Um, I do... I did hear you. You was about five and five, five and six, um, uh, but uh, dipping in and out slightly. I heard you mention something about um, an antenna, and then I heard you say that you were just going to listen and you wouldn't be calling in. So uh, uh, let's see if we can uh, drag you in and get you in the logbook. Uh, G3, Whiskey Mike Radio. This is Mike Zero, Juliet Charlie Fox. Yeah, uh, G3, WMR, M0, JCF. Yeah, no problem, mate. So I've got all of that. You're using a military broadband antenna and um, it's just not working this low down. Uh, Thanks for the five and nine. Yeah, you're still five and five, five and six. I could probably hold a conversation with you. You're just above my noise floor, which is nice. Um, And just for Sam and Dav, um, he's also getting you both five and nine, but not really here 
hearing anyone else. So uh, that that would be why Guy can't hear him. And um, I think he's up. In, I think you said you was up in Bexley Heath. I'm pretty sure you said you was in Bexley Heath. So uh, that would explain why um, uh, some people are, are not uh, being heard. I.e., Guy who's down the hill from Bexley Heath. So I'll hand it back round to you, Guy. Um, I'm sure several people have called in as well. Um, you might want to give out another call. Uh, G zero UK. N M zero J C F. Um, okay, 
Okay, uh, with that, uh, I will pass it round now to uh, Frank uh, Golf Zero, uh, Foxtrot Delta Papa from uh, M0 WDV in the uh, Cray Valley, 160 meter net. Yep, okay there, uh, Dad, thank you very much. Uh, M0 WDV from Golf Zero, Foxtrot Delta Papa. Yep, okay, all copy that from you, 5 and 9 plus signal as well, uh, Dad, to me, because you're not that far away. And um, I don't know whether I did hear a little bit of GA Mike, Mike Whiskey's uh, over from Croydon. I wouldn't, be, I wouldn't say I'd be able to understand the actual amount of uh, the, 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 the actual talk you were saying, but uh, I could hear you he there. And uh, I don't if somebody was on the, on the, on the net there, but uh, obviously not enough to sort of put him down in the, in the log for anything uh, as anything I've got here. But there we are. But um, so, um, Sam, no problem at all there with his S uh, your SJV. You're no problem there, even though you had to get a problem with your antenna falling down and you had to reapply re to it. And you be careful climbing them trees, you know. <laughs> be careful. And um, with the, uh, obviously, the um, uh, station of uh, the GV100 BBC, that's uh, obviously Jim, yeah. Um, when he does go back up towards you, I think he said he's going to change the call sign from the GV to a TX, which is obviously going to be his own station. Uh, the station uh, up there where he, uh, his QTH is on the same same thing like GX100 BBC. So that'll be when he arrives up there. I'm not quite sure exactly what day he's going, but uh, I think he did say choose, choose your Wednesday. He's got to make sure he's get, he can find there's a train running for, to get back up to, to Warwick here from London. But there we are. That's how we'll see how it goes anyway. So when, we, when he gets up, we'll also listen out for him. Um, no doubt Bob will tell us what free is on because he told me he was on the uh, 40 metre band on Saturday which uh, I quickly nicked down here and put on and uh, worked him on Saturday. Could have worked him on the following day on two metres but I'll let the other lads that uh, wanted to work him on two metres on uh, FM rather than me trying to play him because I'd already worked him once. So that's uh, how it worked out. Right now, um, I know that um, GA Mike, my whiskey, he, he's just about audible to me but um, if you can't hear me guys, can you give him a shout and say, oh, I'll switch over to him from G0FTP. Yeah, the call sign's correct, Mike November Yankee, MNY. Round for you, John, in case you weren't talking, Frank, MNY. Uh, that was my uh, my first rig at the time. 
Yeah, M0 uh, SJW, Sam, thank you, and uh, glad I got the call sign and the name that time, and of course uh, the beard as well. Um, <laughs> 5 and 9 plus 15, 5 and 9 plus 20, Sam. Um, John, yeah, John, that's Mike November Yankee, G8 Mike November Yankee. Your readability between 4 and 5, and um, you've got a signal strength for 5, that's if you can hear me, of course, John. Um, what I'm having to do, John, is turn the AGC completely off and just uh, back the um, AF gain control right the way down and I feel that I could probably have a, a conversation with you um, John just to remind you and I do this all the time whether it's 80 metres or 2 metres or wherever um, I'm the bloke who you taught uh, taught my foundation and um, the uh, intermediate at uh, BDARS and I was the bloke who just uh, just after I passed my um, uh, intermediate, I did that little talk on building a J-pole antenna. Do you remember I did that little talk making it out of 15mm copper pipe? And I, uh, I made one actually in the club, like real time. I think it took about half an hour. And uh, you, you loaned me a power lead, if I remember rightly. But uh, that's just to jog your memory as to who I am. Um... Where was I going with this? Um, the G4, BUO, once again, with the AGC off. Um, 
two and one is the best I can give you. It's an estimated one because I've got a uh, a noise floor of S5 and uh, the readability was two. I was getting words every now and again, but with the AGC off, um, I was I was definitely hearing you better. Um, yes, <coughs> as, as I was saying, um, yeah, the radio I'm using the FT one hundred and one ZD uh, Mark Three, so it's got the AM FM. Um, uh, like a, a position on the dial, but you can only have one of the boards fitted. And I've got a feeling uh, that the FM board is fitted in this because um, I switched it on the other day, uh, went round uh, to that position, and um, I was listening to SSB. There was no AM. I was listening to SSB and really couldn't resolve it. I then went to a broadcast uh, band and I really wasn't resolving anything there. So it could be that there's a fault on the radio. It, you know, there, there could be many reasons why I wasn't resolving AM. But um, to my mind, it's most likely he's got the FM board fitted. And at this moment in time, the radio's in such a lovely condition. I am so loathed to actually undo the screws and uh, break the paint seal that's actually still on the screws. But um, I'm feel sure that you know that those seals have been broken. I think it's just um, me with wishful thinking. And as for uh, New Year's resolutions, I don't do them. Um, I'm not known for doing resolutions uh, because I tend to break them. Um, I've just noticed something as well i'm a little bit off frequency the reason being is um uh th this this one does drift as i say about 100 hertz every 10 minutes or so and i'm showing that i'm on 1904 decimal eight um and uh, i do also compensate slightly for guy guy you sound 100 hertz or so off frequency a little bit lower to me so it might be that i've nudged the dial and i didn't nudge it back up I think I've uh, rambled enough and uh, my power seems to be low. I seem to be around the uh, 15 watt mark. So what I might do is just tune off slightly and uh, just um, check this out and give it a quick tune. So uh, I'm not too sure if I'm passing it around to uh, Frank um, uh, G3 WMR. I know he can hear me, but um, he did say that he wanted to listen. So I'll hand it round to you, uh, Guy. G0 UKN M0 JCF. Comments on um, on 
on uh, on things. Actually, no, I'll make some comments first, and then once WMR's had it over, it can go straight round to Dav. Uh, yeah, fine, Dav. I'm noticing my carrier. The carrier suppression on this particular rig is not blinding. <laughs> I know it's not blinding. There is a little bit of carrier leaking through. Um, so uh, you're probably the strongest signal with me. So. Uh, well spotted on that one and um, uh, I've, I've got it I've neutralized it as best as I can um, but it does leak through a little bit um, but uh, there's no law against it so hey it, it's, uh, it's older than most of us on here I think so um, with uh, one or two exceptions but um, it, uh, it, uh, it's doing alright I think um, as for New Year's resolutions I want to lose some weight so there you go I've said it um, because uh, I suppose on weight. I, over last year, I was really, the first year of lockdown, I was really, um, I was really quite particular about going out for walks and carrying on cycling, and uh, then I did quite a lot of cycling in April and May, and since then I've done no exercise, so uh, I want to lose some weight, I want to finish some projects as well, um, uh, yeah, the project I want to see Sam finish is his uh, industrial donut maker, um, which, I, you know, I've done. I know that's not going to, if I, if I see it in action, that is not going to help with me losing weight, but I still want to see this thing work, so that's, uh, <coughs> that's one for you, Sam. Okay, uh, I'll pass it around to WMR. Um, if he's not copying me, somebody else tell him I've passed it, and then it goes around to Dav. So WMR, pass it to Dav. Uh, G3, WMR in the group. G0, UKM. Yeah, not sure if Dad was you copying uh, Frank then back to you. Um, so uh, I'm hoping that they're wrong. Um, so uh, I enjoyed the, the first 
trilogy, uh, but quite, quite difficult to follow, I think. Um, we'll see. Um, but anyway, looking forward to that. Um, so, uh, yeah, with that, I'll uh, pass it around to uh, Frank, uh, I think. Uh, no, it's, no, no, that's all right. No, no, I'll, I'll pass it back to Guy, because I'm, I'm not quite sure. Um, yeah, it is Frank. It is Frank. G0 FTP from uh, M0 WDB. M0 WDV from Golf Zero Fox Dot Silver Bar taking up the mic and leave Monday morning uh, 160 metre net. So uh, yep, okay, no problem there. Um, well, on Monday night, morning, I Frank. Yeah. 